Ah, take it. Whoa! There's an old guy on his back. Almost so I heard it, him say, dare, and refuse. Going down here, I want as little enemies down here as possible. Because they'll just trip me up. It seems like poison cloud. It's not gonna stick to me like the the pool sludge, but this is still gonna be a impediment. Ever hear of holding your fucking breath? Actually, do I have like poison bite rings around? Hmm, no. The vent that helps. Okay, we can pull back to here if needed. Okay, these come back. Completely irrelevant, but they do. Hmm. Hmm. I can't actually creep downwards. I suppose that's one issue this sword has. Please stone. Hmm, they drop fading souls. An extra fifty is an extra fifty, but eh. now one issue here is that I can't um I have one hand on the mouse. Well I can, but it's easier to have one hand on enter. Using the whip. Uh, I suppose none of them appear to be armored. If I have one hand on enter, then it's easy for me to just close things. Torch. Hmm. Not sure if one message just blinked out there. Something in there of note. That's creepy. Either something's nasty over there or people just overextend it. And I suppose what's nasty to one might necessarily be nasty to another. Some builds just handle things better than others, buddy, buddy, blah. blah, blah. Their skill is also relevant. Or lack thereof. Whether I'm referring to myself there or not is up to you. You be the judge. I do miss uh, the Black Knight sword, honestly. While there is one iteration in this, it's nothing like the original.
Black Knight Sword is a beautiful, beautiful weapon. Of the first game is a beautiful weapon, but sadly it's ooh. There's a thing to the right. Um, second iteration just is dip completely different, so that sucks. Some to my right. Yeah. Nope. But, uh, yeah, the second iteration just doesn't measure up. Uh, well, I shouldn't say doesn't measure up. I haven't seen it yet. But apparently it's nothing like the sword from the first game. In moveset and whatnot. Yeah, no, I'm speaking to... Can I be honest with you? Today my mouth has been running riot. Just saying its own thing. And it's like, no. Yeah, apparently it's not like the sword from the first game, it's different, and I can only assume it's lesser for it. So I'm not holding out much hope. I was also thinking that they were saying that this la um I thought I had it. Uh, a ring. They said that it was used a lot in the land that used to be here. Um, it was one of the dragon rings. Uh, I was thinking that maybe this isn't meant to be the game from the area from the first game. It's actually the ruins of the dragon school, the mage school. It's built on the ruins of that. Because of the man... The, the, it's... The, one of the places here used to be a place that used that type of ring a lot. One of the mage dragon rings from the first game. I thought I had one. Seemed not to. Maybe I just dreamt it. But I swear the flavor text for it was that this used... Or you no, know, I read it in a guy's inventory. That was it. Um, I think the guy in the prison. The it, one the the land, one of the kingdoms that used to be here used it a lot, so maybe this was actually built on the ruins of the mage school that we've seen, heard a lot about, that uh, Wogan used to go at, go to and whatnot. Maybe it's built on the ruins of that, because I would imagine they had a lot of those rings, even if they only gave it out to select apprentices. I imagine the teachers had those rings. And a number of those apprentices would have stayed on. Depending on how the school was run, you know? But yeah, my mouth's been running riot today. Like, I was trying to explain different things. Talk to mom. I was explaining NFTs and all this. And just my mouth would not co-op. Would just say its own thing. It's like, no, no, stop. And then it starts run, running riot again, saying its own thing. Did not help explanations. It ended up working out fine, but it was frustrating. But, um... Kind of like the hodgepodge. But, um... Yeah, apparent... Ooh, and those kind of look like teeth. See the thing just above my head, the rock there? Not really sure. But yeah, was, um... The Black Knight sword of this game is nothing like the one from the first game, apparently, in moveset. But stats, are, I would presume, are probably different too. So I'm I'm not really holding out that it's a good thing. I think they said it was more like a zero hander, which isn't. Uh, I think they were saying it's more like. Actually, that's the one I don't have. It's the one I didn't buy. I'll have to see what it's like moveset wise, because who knows? Maybe it works better for me than the Mastodon sword, because it shares the same moveset with the other two great swords I have. The Black Knight Sword from the first game had more of a diagonal swing. 
It had long swings like that too, but it had more of a diagonal thing. Made it better as a cleaved in a sense. Because I wouldn't have the issues of hitting down as well. But anyway. Yeah, that was running right. I'm not saying. I, I, since I haven't tried the weapon out for myself and I didn't even see that remark online, it's wrong for me to say it's, inher it's completely inferior or something. It's just apparently substantially changed. I'm doubtful that it's for the better, but I shouldn't judge it too soon. I'll keep an eye out for it, and if I can't find it, I will look up a guide. And, okay, this wasn't as creepy as I thought. I thought it was a weird spectral arm holding the corpse. Ooh, nice. Really attacked you. You got an aura, annoyingly. But, um. You can kind of see it around him. Right here. It moves with his arms. It's annoying. But, um. Yeah. I'll keep an eye out for it, try and find it, and try and test it out. It could be perfectly fine for my, me to still. It could be different, but still to my taste. We'll have to wait and see. I already have the improved version. Uh, he hasn't really changed, but no, I suppose these are evergreen. Gavlan is useful to sell some stuff off to, but I don't believe really that worth selling. I'm not sure on the point of this. Is it just... Ah. Oh, I never opened a chest with Gavlan. Flee first. Still got poisoned, but I can at least minimize damage. The healing ring also helps in that regard. Far seed and divine blessing. Hmm. I was expecting some of them to get up. You don't mind? Go and see down. Raw stone. He is useful, but I don't think I've found really worth selling to him. Um Hmm, I have a couple of roll swords. Gonna want to keep one of Everton. So, hmm. I wonder if you'd uh, buy those for a lot. I was gonna say sell those for a lot. But that wouldn't make sense. Yeah, these are 500 apiece. Uh, that's a thousand, that's a thousand. If I, I could grind he, uh, f, uh, grind for these. Um, ooh, they scale with lightning. Huh. But, oh, yeah, they do lightning damage. Hmm. Sadly, I doubt they do it uh, just for someone, just for you blocking with it. Probably have to shoe bash, which, not me. I prefer just, just spam weapons. But, uh. Huh. And the Ragdong. But, um. Oh, yes. Go for there. But, yeah, um. Go grind them. <laughs> the, those crazed dwarves give a fair bit, and then I can sell their equipment off for an additional chunk. If I'm stacking item find, it should drop easy enough. And I kill them easy enough. So, win, win, win. I know, I got... One thing I was just thinking there would be interesting. You try and loot a corpse, it comes to life. Stabs you. Wouldn't be surprised if they pulled that in, in, at one stage. Actually, the drinking was him. I swear I hear some movement above, and... Who the hell are you? Is this me, or do they... Are those models really juddery? Like, really jarring? I know, 
maybe I've just stared at too much rock. And I don't mean the little clothing they're wearing, it just... I know, it's just, like, sticking. Sticking out weirdly. Like, there's a weird pop to them. I'm leaving! I'm leaving! Too hard to handle to hold the hold! But yeah, there is an odd pop to them. It's quite irritating, actually. Really? God, I, I'm shit at arrows. And I wasted good ones there, because I don't know how to switch in this game. Let me look it up. Uh, un momento, por favor. Uh. It doesn't say how to switch arrow type. I guess what I could do is this, and then... Hmm, it's not that. Picking the wrong idols to worship. Nice bodies, but yeah, wrong idols to worship. They go down in two goddamn arrow shots. Oh, faker. Okay, let's try not to miss this one. Yeah, I'm not surprised in that. I think I've seen those outfits before. But I've seen the Tunnel War videos, so maybe I just saw them in something. Or maybe it was in one of the many bits of porn. Yeah. Hentai I've seen online. Hmm. Simp! Desert Sorceress Top. Wilted Dusk. Oh, I look beautiful. Dashing. Um, what's... Oh, I can never remember the guy's name. Frank... Zaffa? Zaffa? He did the code number Barbarian Art. People are sharing art he did. Um, apparently, like, apparently he did art for, like, some Lord of the Rings. Like, stuff based off Lord of the Rings. I'm not sure if it was for something or what, but it was meant to be, you know, the girl who went, she was the daughter of that one king, she went in disguise, I am no man, and stabs the ring rate. It was her, apparently someone was complaining about the art he did of her in disguise, because her ass cheeks are on show. But it was either, well, they started off complaining, but either they, they clarified it, or someone else did. That she was in disguise at the time. That's apparently what they all wore. Apparently in all of his art, no one ever wears pants. Everyone's just wearing very goddamn little. It's it's hysterical, especially in like a Order of the Rings kind of thing. It's just She's here fighting ring rates. In <laughs> In a lion court with like a tabardy thing to the front and back. And it's just like you know, Christmas cake ahoy. Well, cake ahoy. Uh, it's... It's fantastic. One, two, three. I feel I kind of mangled what I was saying there, but maybe it's fine. I'll let Future Me decide, because Future Me is a better judge, and I'm a lot more apathetic. <laughs>
Ooh, ten hexing urns. Try projectile. On fire, try right. I hit him in my head. <laughs> uh, yeah, you want to look before you weep. Dark Souls has quite the trolling fandom, and this is actually a great spot to try and get these if they're actually real. Un momento. About face. One thing I'll give to this sword, it's it can actually swing downwards. Tight knight. Tight Knight and Pale Stone. I'm not sure if I want a Pale Stone or an. Um... Ooh, I need to go check something. BRB. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I hear movement. Hater hot stuff. Anyway. Oh no, you don't, you little bitch. Tight night shard, large tight night shard, pale stone. I never really bother co kill, uh, killing these, collecting their loot. But if I'm given an opportunity, I'm more than willing to try. I did kind of forget about some in the Crystal Cave in the first game, but I just couldn't remember where the hell I even found them. Uh, nice. Ooh, definitely don't want to fall down there, Jesus. We're gonna have to, but let's try and get our way plotted out first. Probably is possible to kill sorceresses in melee, but I'm probably going to stick to ranging. Uh, chest, and then down into the poison fog. Ooh! Oh, thank you. That sorts the board problem. Oh. Shit. Fuck. It was my mistake to let myself get pinned in by them. I was hoping to escape. Let's change my kit. Okay. Yeah, it's after 70% that it goes to shit. Alright. So, there's two powerful enemies. You, and he over here. You, I can semi-snipe, and that holy water urn was too useful. Okay. Did 
does not, it really requires contact damage. It's not great at any other type, but a lot of terrain doesn't seem to want to block it. I'm not having none of that shit. Goes the wall. Goes the man in Washington. That's your problem. Check out up here. Switch to melee. Hmm. Were we to bait him into bla breaking? Breaking that too. Hmm. Let me see if he respawns, or have I locked myself out, or is there another way around? Okay, he respawns. Uh, we have nothing to lose but our lives. Come on. No, no. Break the wall. Thank you. Serves you right. Nice. We're gonna have a lot of stones to turn into those birds. Old Knight Pike and Old Knight Great Shield. Old Knight Halberd, old, uh, hold, <laughs> old Knight Pike. An outdate, an, <clears throat> an undated pike, wielded by a warrior from a time so ancient that there exists no record of his, uh, of his endeavors. Record of his endeavors has extremely low durability. Sometimes, just as the thing falls to pieces, I do unleash its last flash of great power. Yeah, only 20 durability. That kind of reminds me of the halberd, the gargoyle halberd, but that, not so much. Hmm. If it's a reference stand, I don't know it. 